All right, hello again. So like uh, we stated in the previous video, it is UFC night and so on. We're making another little snack that will basically be supper as well. And it is cheeseburger spring rolls, family favorite. So all you need for this is one pound of ground beef with half an onion chopped up and fried. And to that, you're going to add two tablespoons of ketchup, which I need a spoon for. One, and two. Two tablespoons of barbecue sauce that you like. I actually like our McDonald's barbecue sauce. I keep it purposely for this. Two teaspoons of mustard. One. And two teaspoons of Worcestershire sauce. And I like to add two baby jerkin pickles, chopped up finely. And mix it up. My meat is still a little warm, so all the juices will pick up the tastes from the sauces. Once that's all mixed, you'll also need about 20 wonton wrappers. I have the little ones. And though I hate using processed cheese in a cheeseburger, of course you need sliced craft cheddar cheese which we are going to just add a little bit of when rolling the wonton wrapper closed. All right, so when you have your wonton wrapper, I bought the small wontons because uh, I wanted them bite size, but if you get the bigger ones, they will come out like a spring roll. We have had them as a main meal, but they're gonna be little babies like this. Just pop them in your mouth. So you're gonna take the wonton wrapper, usually a square, you're gonna go diamond shape down. You're gonna have a bit of water on the side, just so that you can have the side stick when you do roll it. All right, and you're gonna add your stuffing. with a little bit of the cheese right across it then you're gonna take the bottom corner and you're gonna bring it to the top and start start rolling 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 and then you're gonna take some water wet the sides of those corners as well you're gonna take one corner you're gonna close it in Take the other corner, close that in, and continue rolling. Oh. And you're gonna wet that down so that they're all stuck, and boom. All right.
continue to make some more here. All right, so we're putting these little babies into the, the frying pan with some oil. And considering everything is cooked already, it's just to crisp up the wonton wrapper. They're pretty much almost done here. And once these come off, or if you do make these, you can basically make what is delicious is basically like a, a Big Mac sauce. You know, the ketchup, mayonnaise, a little bit of relish in there. Mix it all up and dip these in there. Oh, I'm telling you, it's just a Big Mac and a wonton roll. All right, these are done. Easy peasy. Now, of course, hey, of course, because we're frying these, we have to try it in our air fryer and see if it's works out the same way so be sure to check out that video and see if it works for us all right that's done pretty much okay just get Now, if the oil is hot enough, you won't have that big bite of oil in your mouth, which I think this came out pretty good. So let me let me open it up with a knife. All right. So once you break into it. Ooh, can you hear the crisp? And there's a little meat. There's some cheese that's melted in there. I'm telling you, try them out. They're delicious. All right. So, once again, please subscribe, like, and smash that notification button. <laughs> See you later, guys.